everyone, we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Final Fantasy IX live on Twitch.tv slash Miss Scarlet Tanager, so I will be talking to the chat, like always. We need to go find ourselves a Garnet. I, well, I guess everybody's meeting, but we all know Garnet's probably not going to be there. I like playing this game in 1080p so much better. So much better. It's just, it's just so crisp, and there's so many polygons, and, and it looks like a whole new game. Can I, can I go? Oh, right, I have to talk to these guys first. What? What do you mean I'm not permitted to enter the royal chamber? Am I supposed to go in here, then? Oh, well, then that makes sense. Where's Garnet? Who's that guy? <laughs> it's Regent Sid. What? Still hasn't got any manners. <laughs> Still haven't learned your manners. You can stop the frog talk now. S Silence! Ribbit! <laughs> oh, well. Poor Sid. Ugh, I didn't gather you all to talk about that. I called for this meeting to tell you about what I learned while in Kuja's captivity. It may provide a hint about where he may be. Listen carefully. I don't see the princess! Oh, I missed hearing Steiner's voice. I shall look for her! I will begin constructing Hildegard III. The blue narcissus will be used for its construction. Now, Hilda will tell you the rest. Hilda? Yes, my adorable cheating husband. So, what did the Kuja, what did Kuja discuss with you? Some parts of the story may be hard to believe, but please hear me out. Okay. Kuja plans to use this world as a means of acquiring an even greater power. Greater power? What would he do with it? Destroy the world! I don't know. He indicated that he wasn't of this world. What? He called, we call our world Gaia, but he called his birthplace Terra. Terra, huh? That was not Freya's voice. I am so bad at that. Uh-oh. Time for the team! Baku! Oh god, not to do Baku's voice again. <clears> Hey, <throat> ah, the repair's coming! They're getting really slow. We can crush him, or everything will probably fall apart again. We're not getting anywhere! I've been up here forever! I wanna switch places with someone! I guess the damage is a lot worse than we expected! Huh? She's not here! That's not- St She's not here, either! That's not how I do Steiner's voice! Where could she be? Yo! Oh, it's you. I can't remember how to do Steiner's voice because I haven't done it for so long. Oh, God. Why are you all gathered here? Are you scheming another abduction or something? That's kind of close. Hey! Oh, that's blank. Hey, watch your mouth. We are just discussing ways to restore this district. Yeah! Old timer, you've got us all wrong. Yeah! We're just trying to rebuild our home, that's all. What are you doing here? From the looks on your face, it seems you got problems. What's troubling you? Maybe we can help. Uh, can I really trust you? Yeah? The princess is missing. She's not in the castle, I think it should be in town. Why don't you go back to the castle before you get lost? What? We'll find her, this is like our backyard. I heard me get moving. <coughs> Paku's voice makes me cough, and it hurts my throat. Yeah, no problem. Ahem. Ahem. This terror seems to be connected with a place called the Shimmering Islands. I don't know where Kuja went, but maybe we can find him if we go there. 
Unfortunately, you can't get directly to Terra from the Shimmering Island. Of course you can't. Everyone would have discovered this other world by now if it were that easy. So what do we do? I'll tell you. If you shall shut up! The gateway that connects the two worlds is sealed, but Kuja said there is a place where the seal can be broken. Where's that? He said an old castle located in the northern area of the Forgotten Continent. An explorer left a record of his trip to this particular castle on the Forgotten Continent. If I remember correctly, he wrote that the cliffs were too steep to explore. Other than that, very little is known about the Forgotten Continent, except that's where Oelvert is, and we've already been there. Well, since this castle doesn't have a name, let's call it Ibsen's Castle. Ibsen's Castle, huh? Yeah, we don't know anything about the world beyond our continent, except for the fact that we've been traversing it for the last disc and a half! Oh, Sid's gone. <laughs> I didn't even realize Sid had left the room. How's this ship coming along? Raging, you're human again! Yes, now we can concentrate on building the ship. Judging by our experience at the Hilda 2, we are almost finished with the engine. We're having problems with the construction of the hull, though. Yes, I'm thinking about using parts of the Blue Narcissus for the party. How come? Cause... why not? I realized that the Blue Narcissus was a well-built ship when I rode in it. There are other reasons, but we must hurry. There are other reasons, but I don't feel like telling you. Let's get ready! Roger. That's all I heard. <clears throat> you may find a clue if you go to Ibsen's castle. Did you ask Kuja about all this? These things were these were all things he discussed voluntarily. He became very impassioned as he spoke, and he volunteered information without even my asking. I'm surprised he didn't kill Hilda now that I think about it. He probably thought telling me his plans wouldn't affect his grand scheme. He is right. His power is great and we're at a disadvantage. But we can't- but I can't forgive Kuja! He toyed with my friends' lives! Now we know where we need to go. The problem is getting there. I guess we'll have to wait until Sid finishes building the Hildegard 3. Sidon! I bring troubling news! There's my Steiner voice! <laughs> What's what? What now? I cannot find the princess! I've looked all over Limblum! The members of Tantalus aided me in my search, but... She's not in limp- How did she- How does this woman manage to get under every single person's nose? And then there's only one place. Do you know where she is? I think so. You guys be- You guys wait here in Lumblum. I'm gonna be right back. How did Garn- I know that Garnet probably took the Gargant or something to get to, um... To get there, but how did she by herself get from Limblum to Alexandria without alerting a single person? <laughs> These areas are not exactly close. <laughs> We're gonna look for Dagger. Is there anyone else we need to look for? No, but we looked over there already. Go someplace where we haven't already looked. Sin is so demanding. True, true. Seriously, how did- This is all- What did this take place over the course of a week? How, how did they manage to get from Limblum to Alexandria in less than a day to find her? Never mind. Hey, Ruby! Blank, Marcus, how y'all doing? We're doing alright. How's show business, Ruby? Well, the money ain't no good, but I'm having fun. I like it. <laughs> That's great. Our hideout in Limblum got completely destroyed. It'll take a miracle to fix the place. Bro, we better... Oh, sorry. We came to Alexandria for a reason. Have you seen Dagger? Dagger? No, I ain't seen her. What about her? You fixing to kidnap her again? No, we're just looking for her this time. I was only kidding, Marcus. I'll ask the patrons to be on the lookout. Thanks, Ruby. They seem so nonchalant that the Queen of Alexandria is missing. I wonder if Sedan is here with those good old, with these good old boys. Not yet. <laughs> Not yet, he isn't. 
Oh, I guess it is. Never mind. This is strange. I was sure that she'd be back in Alexandria. Where else can I look? Hey, Zidane, I've been looking for you. Boss, did you find Dagger? Nah, can't find her anywhere. I didn't find Dagger, but... I think I saw that chick. That chick? Yeah, you know, that chick. I'm gonna check again. Hey, wait, who is she? What are you talking about? <laughs> and Zidane goes chasing after another lady. Nobody seems overly concerned about Garnett missing. Where are you going, boss? Is she here? She was standing over there just a second ago. Over there? One of the few times you ever see Zidane's tail move. Beatrix! Is that who I think it is? Yep, it's Beatrix. Beatrix gets out of Dodge quick! <laughs> I get the feeling that she's just fucking with him, because she can probably hear him from there if he's yelling. Yeah, she's just messing with him. Where did she go? Still alive, eh? You are... Baku? Yep, I'm the man who abducted your princess. Let us forget about that. It happened a long time ago. You've got a bit. You've got a big heart, unlike that knucklehead Steiner. No wonder the women are running the show here. <laughs> Boss, you must have seen Beatrix. Hey! It's like, oh, hi, Beatrix. Why were you messing with me before? What did I do to you? As you can see, Alexandria was completely destroyed. Stein and I did our best to protect Alexandria. But our efforts were in vain. Steiner was worried about you. Why haven't you contacted him? Dagger's still in shock. She's been mute ever since the attack. She is. Then it is better for her not to return to this city for a while. It won't do her any good to see Alexandria like this. Well, here's the thing. We can't find her. I thought, she, I thought she'd be back here, but I can't find her anywhere. She's back in Alexandria, but she's nowhere to be found. Have you looked in the resting place? Resting place? Yes, if she's back in Alexandria, I'm certain she'll be there. There are a couple of favors I'd like to ask you. If you see Princess Garnet, please tell her not to worry about Alexandria. She must take care of herself first. As queen, I don't think she'd get that luxury. Sure, what else? I'd like you to give something to her. A garnet! <laughs> We're gonna give a garnet to garnet. <laughs> Maybe we'll help the princess get through this time of uncertainty. So many cutscenes are going on that I'm having a lot of difficulty switching between voices. <laughs> oh, hi there, honey. I've been looking for you, Dagger. Oh, Sedan. You can talk again? Da da da. I I've been thinking since the disaster. I've been thinking that I have to become a queen and bring peace to Alexandria. That is why I came back here, but can I stay with you guys for a while longer? Can I ask why? <laughs> when my mother was still alive. My primary concern was how to talk and look like a princess. Those were the only things on my mind. That didn't change when my mother died and I was about to become a queen. I only thought about how to look and act like a queen. I don't think the people will accept me as their queen the way I am right now. I don't know about that. Your, your, your people kind of love you, so... I have no right to rule over this country. Hmm... <laughs> Zidane's thinking face. Oh, I almost forgot. Beatrix wanted me to give this to you. Have a gigantic fist-sized perfect garnet stone. Is this a garnet? That's right, isn't it pretty? It's beautiful. That gem used to be just another ordinary stone. The stone made a wish. I want to shine. 
That's so cheesy, Zidon! The stone traveled from person to person and keeping its wish. And now it's shining in your hand, Dagger. If you're willing to make an effort, you'll shine too someday. That's so cheesy! Why is Zidon so cheesy? The day will come when Alexandria needs you. There's no rush. The important thing is to have the desire. Thanks. I have to apologize for using you guys in a as an excuse to run away from my responsibilities. Hey, what's important is that you honestly want to stay with us. Beatrice can take care of Alexandria, no problem. Sedan, can I borrow that knife again? Why am I getting Silent Hill 2 vibes here? Which one? The one that helped me make my last big decision. Ah! She didn't take it her! She just took it! <laughs> he just reached over and grabbed his knife. I'm borrowing this. Sedan. Remember the way I was. For me. Why does it seem like she's gonna go off herself? First time I watched that scene, I went, Garnett's gonna kill herself. Just like, well, Eris didn't kill herself, but I thought she was gonna die. Then instead, she just cuts her hair off. And the significance of that moment was lost on all of the Western world. <laughs> Zatan's like, oh my god, she didn't stab herself. Good. <laughs> and now we've got ourselves an airship. Finally, we've got ourselves an airship. I am okay with this. And that means, time for some side quests. Why? Because I said so. Oh, hey, look, it's Aaron. Oh, oh, what happened? What happened to your hair? Princess, what have you done? I know. Zidane broke your heart, didn't he? How dare he? It, it, is that true? Steiner, really? You would love it if she did that. Where's all your harpies? Um, my harp's right next to me. And all of the specters in chats. There's not a lot of people here today. Sedan's right, Echo. Dagger! You can talk again? <clears throat> yes. I'm sorry I made you all worry. It's okay, but your hair! It was so beautiful! Short hair doesn't suit me. Oh no, you look great! That's not my echo voice! What is wrong with me today? I can't do anybody's voice! It's too early to celebrate. Aaron, you know our destination? Yes, Ibsen's castle on a forgotten continent. That's right! We'll go there and find out how to enter Terra through the Shimmering Island. I'm sure we'll find out more about what's going on once we reach Terra. Yeah, and hopefully we'll learn about what Kuja wants to achieve. The location of Ibsen's castle has been marked on the map based on Lady Hilda's information. Please check by pressing select after you depart. You can also press X on the bright spots on the map, and the ship will take you to those locations automatically. You can check how to maneuver the ship automatically by pressing triangle while the large map is open. Oh my gosh! Tutorial, 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 tutorial. Please let me know if you'd like to switch out your party members. Blah 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 blah. Nobody cares! I have my party back! Wait, no, you stay there. I have my party back! And they will never leave my side again. Except when I'm forced to use other characters. Which sucks. Wait, 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 wait. I wanna glitch into the building! Ah! I can't glitch inside Limblom. Darn it, Nappa. I know where I'm going, though. Chocobo time! Bum, bum, bum. Because we still have Chocographs to get. 
Time to party. Yep. Time to choke about. Because I don't want to go to Ibsen's castle. It's Ibsen's castle. Kebe. I got a blue one. Yay. Because I know that I'm still missing chocographs here. At least I'm pretty sure. Let's play it. And then we will go to the second one, because now we can get there. Oh, that's not... There we go. Chocobo. 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 Oh, there's the glacial green that I just used. Hi, Leon! How are you doing? I'm trying to get choke graphs from somewhere. Maybe. Yeah. Seriously? Good game? Oh, there it is! Okay. <laughs> like, wait a minute, game. They recycled Final Fantasy VII map. What do you mean they recycled it? No, they didn't. <laughs> Final Fantasy VII map looks quite a bit different. Where in the world am I going? Is it here? Ah, there it is. Kind of. Oh no, not this bit again! Why'd you get timed out from Sam's stream? What did you do? Well, at least you didn't get killed during XCOM. Like I killed you during XCOM. I mean, what? I didn't murder anybody during XCOM. Nobody at all. I'm just gonna sit here playing some Chocobo minigames. Dum. Oh! I got a Kiwi. Kiwi. Kiwi! Ah. So because you got kicked out of another stream, you came to hang out in mine. I feel so loved. Shh. I did nothing. Everybody's perfectly fine in my in my XCOM stream. I've never lost anybody. Ronnie is not a giant mech suit. What? <laughs> I murdered aliens in XCOM! Give me a chocograph! I just want the last chocograph. Where in the world? In the world? Well, this isn't working very well. Well, bear in mind I don't play Final Fantasy. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm just gonna... We're gonna have to come back to this Choco... The Chocobo Forest anyway, so we're just going to go to the next section of the minigame. That poor Berk... Be that poor Berk... That poor bird is going to have no beard... No beard... English, Scarlet! Stop being so bad at it! That poor bird is gonna have no beak left. Not that poor Burke is going to have no beard left. Why am I bad at English? Why is this inverted? I don't know, I just know that I want to take my chocobo over here. Funniest thing I've done! <laughs> Scarlet gets some new teeth! I don't think teeth is the problem. Yeah, I just can't talk. I am bad at- No! Wrong button! Why did I hit triangle? 
I just wanted to land. Let me land. Maybe it's because I was slightly on the sand. Okay, go for it. Ah, yep, it's because I was slightly on the sand. And apparently airships cannot dock on sand. No, 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 give me a- there we go. That's what I was looking for. I've got a chocobo, 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 a chocobo. You need to have a brain first to get a new one? Oh, Ronnie! I have a brain! I think. I'm pretty sure I have a brain. Where am I going? Um, not that way. This way. Or maybe this, 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 this way. Okay. Go right, not left. Good to know. Why is there a dot there? Oh, wait a minute. That's where the um, chocobo's uh, God. chocobo's air thing is air garden chocobo's air garden that's what it's called god i just want to get over there i have to take the really long way around i just want to grind the chocobo beak away and Get all kinds of nice swag at the same time and go into here now. <clears throat> Chocobo's Lagoon. I think there is the lagoon, the forest, and then the air garden. And then mog nets and the chocobo areas. Mene, what are you doing here? I'm Choco's buddy, Koopo. He knows what we need to do. Let's dig around some more, Koopo. It's tougher to dig at the bottom of the lagoon than it is in the forest. We can only dig in the shallow parts. Choco doesn't like to go in deep water. So the arena is limited. We get half this time, half price. Okay. C can I... Yes, yes. Play the thing. Uh, start. We know how to play this at this point. Okay, wait. Okay, wait. Kiwi. Kiwi! Apparently I can dig in the water now. There it is. Give me stuff! Found a potion. Oh, there it is. I didn't realize it could be like right in the entrance. No! Must! Oh, it's only a potion! My bird's beak is weak. Weak beak is weak. <laughs> Play Chocobo Hot and Cold. Sturt. I want to get Chocograph so I can get awesome equipment for my characters. Because at this point, if I wanted to, I could get all the way to the uh, ultimate weapons. Probably gonna do that off screen though, because that's going to take a long time and a lot of patience. Or something like that. Please, it's only 30 seconds now instead of many, many uh, 60 seconds and stuff. God, I'm bad at English today. No, I was so close. So close. So close. Bum, bum, ba -da, ba -da, ba -da, ba -da, ba -da. I just want to get the ability to go into deep water or mountains or whichever one comes first. I think it's the mountains one. Kiwi. 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 The Kiwi's over here, isn't it? Yep. Somewhere. There it is. And it's going to be another potion, isn't it? Nope, it's a soft this time. Dun, 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 dun. Ooh, more Kiwi. Give me stuff. Give me choke a craft so I can get equipment. No! 
Okay, screw this. We're going to Ibsen's castle. I can do this off screen. Bye, Mene. And it's also the end of this video for YouTube, guys. My name is Miss Scarlet Temperature, and I've been playing some Final Fantasy. I'll see you all in the next video.